Hello, 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 and welcome to Comrade Lev Plays Fallout 4, lowest form of wit run. We are in Good Neighbor, and we've got some business with Bobby No Nose. Bobby. Ready to get to work? No, I followed you down here for the exercise. Funny. Well, you'll get plenty of exercise here. You are gonna be doing some digging. Digging? This is a waste of my talents. <laughs> you want a better job? You gotta work your way up to it, buddy. Show me that can-do attitude. The other two are down there digging already. Go give them a hand, will ya? Uh... Okay. Right, where are the shovels, boys? Let's get to it. I think we can finally get through. Want to see what's on the other side? Oh, yeah. You think Bobby will pay us this week? I don't know, man. It's starting to feel like we're doing charity. But did you just hear something? It's crawling with my alerts. Bail! Bobby can take this job and shove it. Good luck down there, new girl. <laughs> ah, come on. Here we go. Plenty of ammo for this. this. Is the combat rifle We've got loads of ammo for it? So this is what we're using at the moment. So those. Oh, that's one another one. Okay, we've exterminated the Marlux. Now we need to report back to Bobby. Fine. I'm a bit worried about how much damage I took then. Just from a few mile lurks. Oh, where'd you come from? Okay, let's go. What is going on in my tunnel? Looks like we are having crab for dinner tonight. You'd eat mile lurk? Ugh, no. Disgusting. Tough. But somehow slimy at the same time. Well, you stuck around at least. So I guess you're promoted. You get to be my new gun. I think we just need one more guy. An old friend. He'll want a fair cut, but we saw what being cheap got me. I'm not sure I trust you know what you're doing. I hired you, didn't I? Trust me. I'll do whatever it takes to pull this job. First, I think it's best if you actually see what we're after. I have some things to check on in Diamond City. Head over to the noodle shop there, and I'll meet you when I finish up my business. Hello, Lori. I'll see you there. That thing's not a stray, is it? There you are. Was wondering if you were gonna show up. Yes, it's me. I have to hide my face in these parts. People like me are loud around here. Now let's get down to business. That big wall of glass looming over Diamond City is the mayor's office. Most people don't know it, but there's a strong room buried beneath. Mayor's just sitting on top of it. And that's our target. The guy has it coming, if you ask me. With how he treats my kind, maybe he deserves worse. Let's get started. I like your attitude. So, what do you say we make this party a little bigger? I managed to track down my tech guy. His name's Mel, and he is right here in Diamond City. The guy can make a gadget to solve any problem. Thing is, he's a bit... Locked up right now. You have to get him out of there. I can't just stroll into Diamond City security with this face, covered or not. If you really think we need this guy... Trust me, this is the guy we need. Pick a lock, find a key, bribe the guard. The usual stuff. Just get him out of there. All right.
Let's go get Mel. Word of advice. Never call your mother a synth unless she really is one. Yikes. <clears throat> I don't know why they have a jail in Diamond City, because whenever I've broken the law here, they just shoot me. Jeez, Hello, can you please? I like guns too, but you think you might be overcompensating there? <laughs> you definitely. Mel here. Can I help you? Do you come here often? Yeah. Just come here to unwind. Nothing more relaxing than a sparsely furnished jail cell. So I'm guessing you're here because you need something from me. Um, totally unrelated, but I hear that there's an old glitched out Protectron unit back there. Guards asked me to take a look, but it was a real head scratcher. Couldn't do a thing. Officer? You got something to say? You can let Mel out of here, or I will break him out. <laughs> Your choice. It's a little extreme, don't you think? <laughs> the guy isn't locked up for life. Just let him do his time. Mel here. Can I help you? <laughs> uh... I am getting you out of here. If so, maybe you shouldn't be announcing it so every guard in Diamond City can hear. Um, totally unrelated, but I hear that there's an old glitched out Protectron unit back there. Guards asked me to take a look, but it was a real head scratcher. Couldn't do a thing. Okay, so he's mentioned the Protectron twice. Should we just... There's a key here. We just do this. Can we just do Tell this? Me. It ain't just a story. University Point, that settlement on the coast, wiped out since. Let's just happen. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> and that was stupid of me. Right, there's something about a Protectron. Let's look for this. We could just bribe. I mean, it's not going to be that hard nice just to bribe huh? them. 300, we've got the money. Here we go. What can you do, Bubba? No way I'm cracking this. Yeah, that's not going to happen. Mel here. Can I help you? I'm going to get you out of there, Mel. <clears throat> Okay, what about if we get the key? But then a sneaky about opening the door. Let's just get out of here. Yeah, because they didn't actually see me open the door, then he can just walk out fine. Mel. I'm curious what this is about, but let's talk once we make some distance, okay? Well then. Well then. Oh, it's just Thanks the distance. For getting me out. Right. Yes. You so, need those extra few feet. Bobby's new toy. Yeah, this year's hottest gift. Get one before they're gone. I don't really do the whole gift thing. That would require having friends or family. Oh, boohoo. That woman doesn't have a patient bone in her body. I wasn't serving a life sentence here. What? She couldn't wait like a day. What's the job? How'd you like to help break into the Diamond City strong room? Well, damn. That's a big score. Could be enough caps there to keep me going for a long time. Bobby may be shady, but she always pays up in the end. So, I guess I'll get my stuff and head over to her place. Okay, cool. So, meet the gang at the dig. I think what we're gonna do is just gear up a little bit first. So let's get in the old power armor. Uh, 
And let's see if we can do anything with this combat rifle. Oh! Not wild and power armor. Can't exit my armor here. So we've put on a hardened receiver and a reflex sight. That's as we can do. That's good though. Let's go. Alright, let's do this. Alright, guys. Got yourself into trouble again, Mel? What can I say? I learned all from the right. rest. We're all here. Mel, you want to introduce your little friend? Talk about yep. me, I'm a little. Meet Sonia. Hey. This little boy hey. is going to help us move through the earth like a mole rat on jet. Because a robot with no limbs is exactly what you want for your digging operation. What did you expect? A Mr. Handy with a shovel? She's one of a kind. <laughs> I modified her radio systems to emit sonic pulses at frequencies that can loosen any sediment around. Mel says we'll be able to get to the strong room ten times faster than just digging. And it's a hell of a lot safer than loading this place up with dynamite. All right, guys, get ready. I'm not completely sure how this place will respond. So, uh, brace yourselves. Sonia, do your thing. God, I've got power armor on. Flatter. So, what's the deal with the new girl? Oh, I got lucky with this one. Came right up to my door and took the job. She takes orders and she's useful in a fight. What more can I do? She seems to have a good head on the Glad that's over. Any more for any more? Yep. I knew I heard something. Bad. Get the eggs. Oh, no. the thing. There we go. Anybody else want to take a break? <laughs> Good job, Buckmate. Yeah. Well, hello, what's up there? We need Sonya here. No problem. Come on, Sonya. We've got more Marlex. Yeah. I think what I want is to use, yes, my Molotovs. Oh, sorry, Bobby. <laughs> uh, it's maybe a bit confined here for. Uh, <clears throat> right, where's the wall to blow up? This one? Mel, get Sonya over here. Gotcha. Sonya. <laughs> you could have stood out of the way. Come on then. Looks like a subway tunnel. Then we're on the right track. Aha, I see what you did there. What? No. Just keep heading southwest. We need to find a place to blast out of these tunnels. I got them. Ghouls now, probably. Yep.
What a stalker, they're strong. But that is a level up. Let's have a look straight away. Yeah, gun that. We want it. Alright, where are we actually going now then? Uh, is it. Nope. I can't get in there. Through, ha ha, through here. Watch your step as it goes. What the hell was that? Come on, that's all you. Not. Who's there? Good job, dog meat. The thing I like about dog meat the most is he doesn't resent. He doesn't resent me for firing Molotovs at his back all the time. Over here, Mel. Sonia, you know what to do. Won't go. Oh, five mil. I'm out of Molotovs. How come it's been so long since we worked together? I've been trying to keep a low profile on this one, Mel. And I didn't want to get you wrapped up in it unless I had to. We've been through worse jobs than this. Not done yet. Uh, down or encouraging. No flesh off my face. Ay, 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 right. But you two might want to watch out for the who's there. Good start. Holy moly, that's up. His hell. It's not good. Mel <laughs> as well. Right, let's try some drugs. These things are no joke. One, there's another one right there. We good? We're getting really close. There's a brewery near our strong room. This has to be the basement of that brewery. Brewery, you say? Mel, no. Just kidding. Jeez. Did he just get the door open? Yep. Oh, it's a brewery. I hate with this gun, honestly. Hey, it's going on down there. Oh, sorry, dog meat. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Oh, 
<laughs> Scared me. Keeps going on. Bobby's tanking well. Oh, come on. He's tough. Uh. Get out of my face. There we go. Right, can't get that open. But I did see some stim. Yeah. Let's stay around here. Hold on up here, is there? It is. Good. Ammo. Yep, that's good. Way? Over here, Mel. Got it. Sonia, blast time. Blast in time. So this room is the room where you breathe a sigh of relief in survival because you can drop a save here. Well, we don't have to worry about that. Come on, let's keep going. Come on, Sonia, it's blast in time. If Bobby's directions are correct, and I have my doubts, the strong room should be right through there. If you had anything else you wanted to check out in this tunnel, I suggest you do that first. Uh, no? I'm ready. You got it. Let's do this. Ready, Sonia? Bobby. Great. Now my socks are wet. Well, guys, we're right under the Diamond City strong room. You sure this is the right place? I've been mapping it out, and I think Diamond City should be a little further north of here. I don't have a doubt in my mind. How about a little trust for the boss? Well, we can find out the answer. That's right. Let's just get up there. If I'm wrong, oh well, we find another way. We still need a way to get up there, though. Mel? You think your robot will work here? Look at this place. The foundation is already crumbling. One blast from Sonya and I bet the floor above will come right down. Well then make it so. He won't want to be in the room for this collapsing foundation and all. Good, Good point. Thank you. All right then. Everybody clear out. Sonya, prepare yourself for a blast at maximum power. Here I'll we punch you, go. Sonya. That didn't sound good. Sonya's okay. Now let's get up into that strong room, shall we? Let's do it. Oh no no no, Sonya! Pull yourself together, Mel. We don't need that thing anymore, anyway. But we can make another what we got? All kinds of strong. This is an amazing so far. Bit of oil's good for me. Oh, I see through here, bro. Bobby, what are you doing here? Shit. You seriously didn't think Hancock would catch wind of your scheme? He took you in, Bobby. And you're stealing from him? Don't listen to her. Hancock shouldn't care about us stealing from Diamond City. I'll catch your yeah, Lev. About that. I see the rest of you are in the dark about this. Nice, no-nos. You all just broke into Hancock's storeroom. You know. Hancock. The mayor of Good Neighbor. Damn it, Bobby. Listen, guys. I know this isn't what you expected. But there is still a ton of caps on the line here. Help me take her out. And all of it is ours. This is Hancock we're ripping off here. The guy tends to hold grudges. Counteroffer. Just go back into your tunnel. And we can forget this ever happened. What do you say? So, 
I don't really want to cross Hancock. Bobby has totally tricked us. But the thing is, the thing is, Fahrenheit has a minigun. She has a really nice minigun that I want. I am going to see this through, Bobby. You won't regret this. Might as well finish what we started. Uh. Wrong move. <laughs> you. I've got crit, but that should do something. Oh, didn't do a lot. You're tough, Fahrenheit. Looks like one of these trigger has got a flamer as well, actually. Which will also be pretty good. So, let's get the combat rifle out. Let's get some healing going and let's hit a jet. We're actually running a little bit low. I want that gun, Fahrenheit. Oh my god, I can't shoot for shit. Got it. The loot must be in that closed train car. Let's open it up. Huh. Fahrenheit probably had the key. Where'd this trigger man go? I want that. He's got a flame on one of them. And a hazmat suit. Come on, give me your... What did you have? Nothing interesting. There she is. Yes. Ashmaker. Sets target on fire for 15 points of damage. Really? Well, I don't, I've never used it before, so I've no idea how good it is, but that feels like really good if that's a, a bullet. No, because it just sets you on fire. Whatever, it's cool. It's going to set people on fire. Brilliant. Uh, you've got the key. You've got a load of ammo. That's great. And do I want some of your armor too? I don't know if I've got a metal chest piece. Alright, I've got the key. Oop. Let's go. Let me check it out first. No, no way. There's honestly nothing that good in here. Our stealth boy. Bit cash. You happy? No, you're looking at the paperwork, fine. You happy? Bobby. That's what I'm talking about. Gotta be tons of dirt on Hancock in here. Yeah, well, I'm just glad we made it through all that alive. And now you get paid for it. So quit your whining. And you, I couldn't have pulled this off without your help. No thanks to you. Uh, I'm a supervisor, kid. I decide what information is need to know and what isn't. You want to complain? Or you want your cat? Cap, please. Here is your share. You done good, kid. Enjoy. So, decked out with a brand new legendary minigun which sets people on fire. I think we'll call it a part there. Uh, thanks so much for watching and until next time, take care and goodbye.